Bill Williams Stadium in Lynchburg, home to the Liberty Flames, and fans have been eagerly anticipating this clash and filling up this stadium quickly. We have a ranked versus unranked battle coming up here, and you know how chaos can ensue if they start smelling an upset. As we'll see, the Pandas taking on the 22nd ranked team in the land, the Liberty Flames. It's 48 Sports College Football. I'm Reese Davis, joined here in the booth, as always, by David Pollock and Jesse Palmer. Here's the handoff. He's... Here's this offense with a fresh set of downs. He'll keep it himself. Runs through a tackle. They'll force it. At some point in this game, he's going to break a home run. Defense did a nice job getting this guy do his thing. And the Flames have it with a first and ten. Use the play fake. Now to throw. Let's it fly deep downfield. Ball into the end zone. And it's intercepted. Now on the option. And they'll stop it from the shotgun, the inside give. Tackle is made. You want that first down. Uh, understand the situation. Understand I got to get north and south. Get a first down. Get a new set of downs. At the 45 on his way. Can anyone catch him? He's at the 10. Touchdown, play. And once he found some daylight, it was time to make a house call. I love the execution on that play. Great blocking up front just to get the ball carrier an opportunity in the second level of the defense. And at that point, it was make a guy miss and use the speed. That was a perfectly executed play. He takes over the Flames, sending the offense back onto the field. Jesse, a very productive drive last time wound up with a touchdown. Yeah, mix. When you put together a drive like that, I would do more of the same. Keep the pace, keep it going. A short from the 44, and we might know if they plan to go for it on fourth down by what they call here. They'll try to bully their way for the first. The offense set for a first down play. Use the play fake, now to throw. And they get... Play action pass success has a lot to do with selling that fake. You could tell defense was not buying it, got in the backfield, got the big play. Shakes off the defender. I'm on the ground, short gains to set your defense for positive situations down the road. On third and long, hoping to throw beyond the sticks. And that the Flames will try to pin them back with the punt. Takes over and the Flames offense ready to go to work. They've jumped on them, executing at a high level and up 14-0, David. This has gotten stops. You're in a position now, Paul, to put the hammer down and get a three-possession lead. I'm really impressed with their physicality. Gonna let it fly. And they want it. Defender being in a good position for that deep ball down the field, not letting the receiver put his big body on him, go up over top. The only thing that could have been better is that they tipped to another defender, and it was an interception. Open runway ahead. They'll make the stop, but not offense. It's like running a perfection drill in practice against air. Chunk play after chunk play, and here they come again. Picked off. He would have loved to make the big return there. Get set, get set. Back to throw, it's Salter. Starting to feel a little pressure. Fires to the end zone. And that pass picked off. First down, here comes this offense. He'll start this third quarter with a run. Finds that crease, and he's got to establish the line of scrimmage, and they're running downhill right at this. And the ball is free on the pitch. And the defense has it. Everybody's working from the pistol. Off play action on first down. Time to take a shot. And the DB that one up in the air and force it incomplete. Throws to the wide out. Just missed it. It's so tricky for a quarterback. You've got to be pinpoint accurate and have great timing. You didn't see it there from the QB. 
And he's not going to games. We'll punt this one away. This will be the second time they've had to kick it away. A fair catch. Called for and made. Liberty takes over the Flames, sending the offense back onto the field. Last time, David, it was one, two, three, kick. That last drive, that three and out, sometimes that puts your defense in a high. They got to do something here to get this defense on the heels. He's knocked down, touched him, and he slanted right into the backfield, made the tackle for that. Safe completion on the screen. Still on his feet at the 45. Nothing but green ahead. And he'll take it in and house it. Touchdown, Liberty! Man, how hard is it to defend when you have a weapon like this at running back that can play wide receiver? You can design ways to get the football in his over to dip into its bag of all plays. Quarterback on the keeper. Got enough for the first down. 36-yard line, it's first and 10. And they'll bring him. Best for me in this game. What can I lean on right here to make sure we win this one? We we'll give you a shot of momentum. On third and long, he has to throw for it. They're setting up the screen. And they wrap him up. But miss stop and put their team in a position to win. On the run, still looking. He'll fire to his right. And it falls in. I got to continue to play the deep pass down the field. I can't just run up and try to go tackle him. Nice down and short. The give and tick, 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 tick. Not going to risk a return. With plenty of pre snap movement of their own. Liberty takes over and the Flames offense ready to go to work. Guys, you want to be productive here and not go into a shell, but you've got to take care of the ball. Yeah, and I think you said for this to be aggressive. Way up near the line of scrimmage, bringing a bunch of bodies, trying to stop the run. And that's why it puts a lot of pressure on an offense, David, because you know if you do try to flex, it's going to be into a small window. It is not easy to execute in this situation of the game. Trying to get to it. It's complete! And he will score! Touchdown, Flames! They add on to this lead, and it looks as if they'll be moving to 2-0. And, oh. and you know, late in the games, offenses sometimes get conservative when they got the lead and they got the ball. I love this offense. They were aggressive. They got another score added to the lead. Now you're trying to salt this game away. Quarterback, quarterback will take a knee that he can stop, can stop one more time, more time if we are supposed to be an all shooter. All, sure. all, all the business, business today is this ball, 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 they come out and they get to win. win. And that's, that's all the best. It's not always pretty. Uh, uh, you know, almost do everything you want to do or check all the boxes. But at the end of the game, yes, you want that dub. No doubt about it. They made the plays they needed to make in order to get this win. I thought the quarterback should have been the most important leadership throughout the course of the game. So that's going to do it for us. For Jesse Paul, for David Paul, and I, David Sexton. So long, this has been another presentation of the Sports College Podcast.